getting ready for the U of L UK football game on Saturday. And Julie Lair from DIY Louisville is here to talk about how you can make a huge party a success and decorate without a lot of expense. Right. Julie is a U of L grad, so she's wearing red and black. It just so happens I'm wearing blue, so we're balanced like the table yes. today. And Julie, where should people start if they're looking to do something creative? But I, I'm one of those people, I'd love to have a table like this, but I don't feel like I really have the creative juices to pull it off. And you say it's simple. I, it's very simple. Um, the first thing that we did was we created a tablecloth that kind of looks like a football field. We took green felt and added um, tape to it to create masking the... Masking tape. Yes, masking tape to create the lines. To, uh, to create the football field. So that's where we started, and then we started building up our football now, field from there. I have to say the beauty of felt, for people like me, is you don't have to sew it. You no. just cut it. You just cut and it. it's ready to go. It's ready to go. Very Simple. easy. All right. And um, so we wanted to be impartial to our teams this com coming up this weekend. So we created a U of K side and a U of L side. All right. And the first thing we did was we wanted to create symmetry on both sides to keep the table really balanced and keep it visually very appealing. So everything that we did for the U of L side, we also did for the U of K side and just the alternate colors. Now, you've gone, you have just simple little, you know, plasticky. Yes. Uh, holders for your pretzels and popcorn, right. but then you dress them up to make this look like a much more fancy table. So what are some little things we can do to embellish the dishes and make them look a little more interesting like this one? Um, the great thing here is uh, Crafty McGee designed all of these uh, printables that we have here. You can print them for free on her website, craftymcgee.com. Okay. But they create kind of a, a cute element to the table. They tie everything in together. Uh, we created these pennants. The put cupcake bows coppers. On the, you put bows just on the handles of the buckets. Yes, yep, and uh, these little circle cutouts uh, are the same ones that we use for the cupcake topper. So you can see that you can add them to different elements to your table. They're not restricted to just one area. Buy yourself a roll of ribbon and go to town. Yes, right? and All the, right. the other thing that we did was we kind of dressed up our water bottles. You know, we like to dress up everything that we can as much as we can. Mm -hmm. And again, yeah. these are a printable that Crafty McGee designed, and you can. So that's already the right size. Yes, that's just, the nice thing about this. You cut it out, you wrap it around your water bottle, tape it to the back, and then you've got another decorated element for your table to yeah. kind of tie everything together. That's yeah. really cute, and you can add ribbon or whatever you'd like to embellish. Now, right. in just a little while, we're going to be back with Elizabeth McGee, Crafty McGee, and she's going to show us a little bit more about how to do the cupcakes and decorate the food a little bit more. Yes. Makes a little football cupcakes right. as well. If you want to get in touch with Julie and, <coughs> excuse me, Elizabeth, we have links on our website to them, DIY Louisville and Crafty McGee. They both have blogs with some really clever ideas, not only for your football tailgate or your party, but for other things that you can do through the fall season. So you can head to WDRB.com, click on the morning show page, and we'll have a link to Julie and to Elizabeth, and Elizabeth will show some cupcakes in just a little while. Right. Thanks, Julie. Thank you.